Number 98, Brock Bernhardt. Number 22, Tyler Conzo. Number 20, Miles Cotton. Number 10, Jaden Famigetti. Number 5, John Gargiulio. Number 44, Dominic Green. Number 76, Jackson Lamouth. Number 66, Derek Mars. Number 26, Matthew McDermott. Number 3, Colin Murphy. Number 12, Luca Pace. Number 80, Matthew Passarello. Number 55, Max Stein. Number 8, CJ Stein. Number 60, Blake Stockwell. And number 14, Dylan Zizzo. Good morning, Bulldog Nation. Thanks for joining us here at Red Wolf Video Productions. We've got our final Bulldog Spotlight Game of the Week. This is a championship matchup in the eight-year-old division. We've got Russ Pace's nine-year-old, sorry, facing off against the Lions from Longwood. Longwood is taking the ball out first. They've got first and 10 on their own 35. In just a moment, we'll be underway. Ball pops out early. Looks to be recovered by the Bulldogs. Recovered by the Bulldogs. It'll be first and ten for the Bulldogs from the Lion 38 yard line. Early fortune for the Bulldogs here. They'll take the ball over on their own on the Lion 38. After the fumble recovery, the Bulldogs have first and ten. Moving the ball from right to left on your screens at home. Yeah. 
Quarterback Tyler Conzo settles in on the center with two backs in the backfield. Got a full start on the offense. That's going to back him up a bit. We'll be right back after that penalty is assessed. After the penalty, the Bulldogs are looking at first and 15. Wing back off on the left. Two backs in the backfield. Handoff goes to number 66. That's Derek Mars on the carry. Number 66, Derek Mars on the carry. Second down and 18 for the Bulldogs. Handoff goes to Mars again. He works his way around the corner. And is pushed out around the 42-yard line. Number 66, Derek Mars on the can of paint. Third down coming up for the Bulldogs. One back in the backfield. Receivers set out to the right side. Twins. Conzo under center. Takes the snap. Rolls out. Evades trouble. But is ultimately brought down about the 43 yard line. No gain on the play. Number 22. Tyler Conzo on the. Punting is number 98. Brock Bernhardt. And the punt is downed on the 28-yard line. Lions will take over, first and 10. After the punt, first and 10 for the Lions. Taking the ball out on their own, what looks to be about 28-yard line. Ball carry makes their way up to about the 33. Second and three for the Lions. Two backs in the backfield. One receiver set out to the right side. Quarterback under center. Takes the snap and hands off to a tailback. <laughs> Running back brought down at about the 41 and a first down pickup. Number nine, Jamari Hoop on the carry. Fresh set of downs here for the Lions. First and 10 on what looks to be about the 41 yard line. Hand off to the tailback, number 33-0. He's pushed out of bounds at just about the 50 yard line. Number 30, Shane Cassidy on the. Second down and two to go for the Lions. Ball spotted on the 50. Apologies for this post, but they do have lights here. Handoff goes to the tailback again. He's wrapped up in the backfield. No gain on the play. On the dive. Roughly third and two for the Lions. Still move the ball from left to right here in the first quarter. Three backs in the backfield. Quarterback hands off to a halfback. Makes his way through past the first down marker. Brought down at about the 46. on the carry. First and ten for the Lions. Number nine again carrying. Flag on the play. Number nine brought out of bounds at about the 35, 36 yard line. After the holding penalty was assessed, they've been backed up to the 46 yard line on their own side of the 50. Repeating first down. Halfback number 30 carries, spins out of trouble way back in the backfield, is brought down at about the 36 yard line for a 10 yard loss. Number 30, Shane Cass Second down coming up, 26 yards to go. First down marker is up on the opposite 46 yard line. One back in the backfield, motion. by number three, Colin Murphy. Bringing it back down for maybe a gain of one. 
Lions facing third down and very long. Ball spotted on their own 40. First down marker way up on the Bulldog 46 yard line. Ball spotted on the left hash defensively. Three backs in the backfield. Handoff goes up the middle. He pops outside. Flag on the play, two flags on the play. I think we got a face mask call. Cassidy on the carry. Repeating third down after a face mask penalty has been assessed. Why did they move the change though? Oh, automatic first down? And why would it be a third down? Running back brought down at or about the 50. Lions will be punting it away here, facing fourth and about 14. At this age, I believe they're still gifted 20 yards regardless of the outcome of the punt. That punt tumbles forward. Punting for the Lions is number 12, Ryan Green. The previous play concluded the first quarter. The teams have now switched sides, and the Bulldogs will be carrying the ball from left to right on your screens at home. First and ten after the punt. Motion in the backfield. Two men in motion is going to be a penalty. Flags fly from all three refs. You took the carry on 66. The penalty on the previous play was declined. The Bulldogs are looking at second and 15 after a loss of down, loss of yards on the previous play. One man in motion. Conzo keeps, gets his way around the corner. He scoots out of bounds at about the 45 yard line for a long pickup. Number 22. After a long run by Tyler Conzo, number 22, we got first and 10 for the Bulldogs. Ball spotted on their own 44 yard line. One man in motion. Whoa, big blitz by number nine. Puts a five yard hurt on the Bulldogs. Back them up. Second and 14 coming up for the Bulldogs. One back in the backfield. Two receivers to the offensive left. Conzo keeps. He's wrapped up at the 40. Conzo on the carry from Keith. Third and 13, third and 14 maybe here for the Bulldogs. Two backs in the backfield. End in motion. That was number 60, Blake Stockwell on the carry. No gain on the play. It's number 61. What he said. Come on, Brock. Ball comes to rest at about the 47. First and 10 for the Lions as they take over on their own 39 yard line. Quarterback rolls out to pass. He is brought down for a big loss at the 25 yard line. That's number 98, Brock Bernhardt on number the tackle. 12, Ryan Green is sacked on the play. Second down and 23 for the Lions. First down marker is way up on the 50. Once again, that's Brock Bernhardt doing damage in the backfield. Jamari Hoop on the carry. Four minute warning declared here as we get ready to start the next play. Third down and nearly 30 to go. At 25 at least. Bernhardt again in the backfield, swinging. Oh, big dog pile on the running back for another loss of maybe four or five yards. The fourth and 30, they've elected to punt. Oh, 
24-yard punt on the play. Bulldogs will take over, first and 10 from the 44-yard line. First and 10 for the Bulldogs on the Lions' 44-yard line. One back in the backfield, power right. Quarterback under center. Conzo trips, drops the ball. Fumble on the play. Is recovered by the Lions. Going recovered to the by the Lions. Injury on the field after that last play. He's getting looked at. We'll be right back. Luca Pace was injured on the previous play. He's made his way off to the sidelines and he's being checked out by a trainer. First down coming up for the Lions as they move the ball forward from the 46 yard line, right to left on your screens at home. Running back is brought down after a pickup of nearly seven. Second and three. Okay. Number nine carries. Wrapped up in the backfield. Lunges forward back to the original line of scrimmage. Maybe a short yard uh, loss. Third and three for the Lions. SJM being cautious about getting called off on a hard count. One back in the backfield, two wing backs off to the offensive left. One giant pole in the way. The wing backs have balanced out. Number 30 carries. Makes his way back up to the line of scrimmage, maybe plus a half. Brings up fourth down. Fourth and two. The Lions are looking to go for it. Handoff goes up the middle. Number nine is stopped in his tracks at the line of scrimmage. No gain, turnover on downs. Smart. St. James, Wisconsin, zero. Longwood, zero. Heading into the halftime break, it's a good time to thank you again for joining us here at Red Wolf Video Productions. If you don't mind, click that thumbs up button, tell us how much you like us, click the subscribe and tick that notification bell so you're notified each and every time we post up a new film. We'll be right back after this halftime break. Welcome back from that halftime break. Uh, opening up the second half here, the Bulldogs will have the ball. They're moving the ball from left to right. They are taking it out on their own 35-yard line. They've got one back in the backfield, a wing off on each side, and Tyler Conzo settles in under center. He is brought down by a blitzing number nine. After a four-yard loss on the play, we've got second down and 14 for the Bulldogs. Muffed snap brings up third down. Third and 14 for the Bulldogs. Conzo rolls out, looks to pass. Connects with number three, Colin Murphy, who is brought down right at about the first down marker. Murphy is complete. 
Unfortunately, a holding penalty on the previous play negated the gain. They got backed up 10 more yards and looking at uh, second, excuse me, third and pretty long, 20 plus yards. Once again, Conzo rolls out, connects with Murphy out of bounds. That'll be incomplete, brings up fourth down. Facing fourth and long, the Bulldogs have elected to punt it away. Punter Brock Bernhardt shanks it off to the left, comes to a rest at the 35. Bernhardt's punt is down. The Lions will take over. <laughs> After the punt, the Lions have first and 10 from the 41 yard line. Moving the ball from right to left. Hand off to number nine. He shakes some tacklers in the backfield, but is brought down at about the 43. Number nine, Jamari Hoop on the carry. Second and 12 for the Lions. Handoff goes to a running back in the backfield. He works his way through trouble, makes it up to about the 26, sorry, 24 yard line. 34 yard line that is. Third and what looks to be almost four with the ball spotted on the 34 yard line. Lions looking to extend their run. Handoff goes up the middle. He bumps into a blocker. Is brought down. Oh, is tangled up by Mars. Number nine shakes some tackles. Brought down at about the 27. First down, Longwood. A fresh set of downs for the Lions. First and 10 with the ball on the 27. Running back number nine shakes off more tacklers in the backfield. Continues to move, stays on his feet. Wrapped up hard by number three, Colin Murphy. Lots of running, little gain on the play. Second and nine for the Lions. One back in the backfield. One in motion. Hands off to number nine who goes off guard. He is wrapped up at or about the line of scrimmage. Early whistle for safety. Maybe one or two yards on the play. Third and seven for the Lions. One back in the backfield. Two wings off to the left. Nobody in motion. Quarterback looks to keep. Works his way upfield. Big push up to about the 16 yard line. Previous play awarded the, the Lions a first down. First and 10, one back in the backfield. Number nine carries up the middle. He's got room to run. He's brought down at about the two. First and goal for the Lions. One back in motion. They go to number nine again, who is brought down by number 98, Brock Bernhardt. Second and goal from the four. The Lions looking to put the first points on the board. One back in the backfield. Two wings off to the left. Whistles before the snap. Timeout Bulldogs. We'll be right back. Timeout Bulldogs. Tom was the worst. I thought Tom was going to kill me. After the timeout, the Lions have second and goal from the four yard line. Once again, looking to punch the first point onto the board here in this championship game. One back in the backfield, two wings off to the left. Nobody in motion, quarterback keeps. Works his way into the end zone for a Lions touchdown. Six points on the board for Longwood. Longwood will be going for a one point conversion attempt on the three yard line. Stop it, boys! Pre-snap whistle. False start on the offense. We'll be right back. Yeah. 
after the penalty. Quarterback drops back to pass for the extra point. That'll be incomplete. No points for it. After that extra point attempt, that did wrap up the first, excuse me, the third quarter. In between, we've switched sides, and the Bulldogs will now be carrying from right to left. First and 10 from their own 35, and now back to the action. Three receivers out to the offensive left. Nobody in the backfield. Conzo scrambles out. He is brought down at about the 40. Second and four coming up for the Bulldogs. Two backs in the backfield, one wing off to the offensive left. Conzo on the center, takes the snap. He scrambles back to the other side. He's brought down for a loss at the 35 yard line. Conzo's brought down for a loss on the play. Third and 11 for the Bulldogs. Three receivers out to the left. Conzo keeps again. He gets around the corner. He's pushed out of bounds. Six gets a first down. First and ten. Derek Mars looks to make some room. Got some room. He's got room to run. He's brought down at about the 40. The ball pops out. That is an active, uh, active fumble, and the Lions recover it. There was a holding penalty on the previous play, which was declined by the Lions. So they've got a first and 10 after recovering the fumble. Ball spotted on the 32-yard line. Hand off to number nine. He is brought down, or tangled up at least, on the 34. Jamari Hoop on the carry. Second and eight for the Lions. Ball was spotted on the 35 yard line. Hand off to the running back in the backfield. Shows some patience. Gets tumbled forward up to about the 37. Third down and six to go here for the Lions. Quarterback keeps. Scrambles upfield. Flag on the play. He's got room to run. He could go all the way, but unfortunately with a flag on the play, this is likely going to come back. It is indeed a holding call. That touchdown will be called back. Keep your head up. Hey, you want me to do it? Come on, All right, so after that penalty was assessed, third and 18 for the Longwood team. Running back stays on his feet for a while, but is brought down at our about the 26 yard line. Longwood's elected to punt on the play. What he said. That was number three, Colin Murphy back to receive the punt. Ball to be spotted on the 40. All right, after the punt, what may be the last possession of the game here? I have no notion of time, but I'm guessing we're late in the fourth. We've got a first and 10 from the Lions 48 yard line right behind this light post. We got motion. Shake it off, let's go! Five yard penalty against the Bulldogs. That's gonna back them up just a bit, we'll be right back. First down and 15 for the Bulldogs. One back in the backfield, two receivers out to the left. Handoff goes to Mars. He evades some tacklers, but is dragged down for a loss of three, maybe four. Second down. That's Tyler Conzo scrambling out. He's got room to run. He works his way up the field. First and 10 for the Bulldogs after a long Tyler Conzo run. 
Conzo is wrapped up and slammed down in the backfield for a loss of maybe nine. Tyler Conzo shaken up on the previous play. He's come off the field. Back from this angle, I can't tell who the backup quarterback is. It might be Famagedian. Fourth down and 11. Famagetti drops back to pass. He evades and runs upfield. He makes his way up to about the 35 before being pushed out of bounds. And picked up first down. After the first down pickup, the Bulldogs have first and 10 from a line 36 yard line. Doing my best to crop this post out of this frame. Conzo keeps, he evades, he's getting tripped up, he loses his, his muff, he makes his way around the corner, he makes his way into the end zone. <laughs> out of bounds at about the 35 yard line after a what is that a 30 yard gain timeout called by the Longwood Lions we'll be right back first and 10 for the Lions with the ball spotted on the 35 yard line big block there by number 26 opens up a hole for number nine who scampers his way up to about the 20 the 18 the 17 yard line Sweep goes to the right. Makes his way up to about the eight. Second down and two from the nine yard line. Flags fly before the snap. False start on the offense. He's going to back him up a bit. We'll be right back. Five yard penalty. Number nine works his way up to about the goal line. No indication of touchdown. Hoop on the key, pushed out of bounds. Timeout called. Ball mark looks to be about on the two. Timeout Lions. Hoop on the 11 yard gain. Coming back from a long wood timeout. The ball is spotted on a two yard line. I believe it to be first and goal. Likely only a few moments remaining in the game in regulation time. Quarterback keeps. He is spun down in the backfield for a five yard loss. And there was a fumble on the play, but the Bulldogs recover. And that's the end of regulation, folks. We'll be going into overtime. So the Bulldogs took a knee there. Regulation time has expired. Overtime coming up. We'll fill you in on those rules when we get back. And in overtime, but we'll be starting from the 20-yard line. Teams only have one first sound to gain. No. If a team scores, the other team has the opportunity to score and possess the ball. 
very similar to baseball. Each inning, each inning, each team only has one timeout. A turnover ends the series immediately. You cannot score on a turnover. All possessions begin from the attacking 20-yard line. Overtime opening up, first and ten. Quarterback number nine keeps, dances his way through the defense. He is brought down to a stop at around the 13 yard line with a bulldog pileup. Gain is six on the play. Second and five for the Lions. Quarterback he keeps again. He's wrapped up by number 12. That's Luca Pace for the tackle in the backfield. Down in the backfield. Third down and about seven to go. Running back wrapped up in the backfield for no gain on the play. Fourth and nine for the Lions. First down marker is up on the 10. Ball spotted on the 19. Ball hits the ground, picked up. Hits the ground again. Turnover on downs. Bulldogs get a shot here. After stopping the Longwood Lions on fourth down, the Bulldogs will now take over with an attempt from the 20 yard line. They've got one attempt at a first down, one timeout. Ball spotted on a 20, middle of the field. Off we go. Tyler Conzo settles in under center, one back in the backfield, two receivers off to the left. Conzo rolls out to his right. He's chased immediately and brought down for a 10-yard loss on the 30. Second down and 20. Ball spotted on the 30. Two backs in the backfield. Wing off to the right. Wing in motion. Oh, no. Fumble. Recovered by number three, Colin Murphy. Ball fumbles on the play. Recovered. Third down and 23 for the Bulldogs. Ball spotted on the right hash on the 37 or so yard line, 38 yard line maybe. One back in the backfield, one receiver way out to the left. Conto drops back to pass. He's under pressure. He connects with Colin Murphy up at about the 20 yard line. That gets them up to the original line of scrimmage. Big gain on the play. Fourth down coming up. Fourth and 10 from the 20 yard line. Two wide outs to the right. One back. Derek Mars, number 66, in the backfield. Tyler Conzo keeps. He's chased backwards. He scrambles. And he is wrapped up back at the 30-yard line for a turnover on downs. That'll bring up the next inning where we'll flip sides. We'll be back in a moment. Conzo South. Lions will be taking over first and 10 from the 20-yard line in second overtime. Running back lunges to the 15 for a five-yard pickup. Poop on the carry. Second and five for the Lions. One back in the backfield. Quarterback under center. He calls for motion. Running back brought down at the 11. Who brushes forward for a game of five? Third and one for the Lions. Man in motion. One back in the backfield. Hand off to number nine. He works his way out of trouble. 
and he's into the end zone for six points for the Longwood team. No flag on the play. The Lions are looking for a one-point conversion here. Present score is 12 to six. Hand off to number nine again. He is wrapped up by Bernhardt in the backfield. No gain on the play. Conversion is no good. Score will remain 12-6. We're in the bottom half of the second overtime. Score is still 6-12 in favor of the Lions. Tyler Conzo rolls out to pass and is wrapped up for a seven-yard loss. Ball to be spotted on about the 27-yard line. To the Bulldogs. Timeout called by the Bulldogs. We'll be right back. Timeout, Bulldogs. Second down and 16 to go. We have a player running off the field. They're going to call that illegal motion. They called too many players on the field, tried to send one off, flagged it and pulled it back. One back in the backfield. Wings on both sides in tight. Conzo rolls out, looks to pass, sends it upfield. Where it is intercepted by Longwood and that will put a cap on this game. And that's the game. So we've got a final score. We'd like to congratulate both teams on a wonderfully played game. Unfortunately, the Bulldogs are going to go home with a loss on this championship game with a final score of 6-12. to 12. Interception in the second the overtime score, ending this Longwood game. 12. St. James, Wisconsin, six. I want to thank you again for joining us here at Red Wolf Video Productions. We enjoyed helping you with your spotlight games of the year. Hopefully you'll give us a thumbs Once up, again, click like that like button, click the subscribe, tick the notification bell every, every time you watch us. Game. So that way you know every time we put up a new film. Thanks again. Have a great ride home, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday afternoon. We ask that